Hi, hi, good morning, everyone. I hope you're all doing great, and I hope that God is protecting all of you. It's a beautiful day here. Guess what? Today is 26th of November 2023. And for those of you who have been OGs and OBs of this channel, you know that 26th is our anniversary, baby. And I make eight months in this relationship. So we have decided that we are going out of home to celebrate our anniversary and we are going to hotel number five yes we're going to hotel number five in Entebbe that's where we're going to celebrate our day from honey are you excited i can't wait this is such a special day it's been nothing but two thumbs up so far but you didn't say hi to the people hi people steve here as always yeah so bags packed everything packed the only thing i have forgotten to pack is my charger we were in a rush and I totally forgot to iron my blazer. It's such an embarrassment. I am so sorry. But we were in a rush. I also wanted to open this kitchen. Okay, I'll be opening one by one in every other video <laughs> because, man, I just can't. Oh my god. Any ideas? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. But. Oh god. Is it a, is it a tough cookie? Yep. I think in every video I'll be opening there you go. one of the remaining gifts and then we shall see what is here. Hey, honey. Thank you, baby. Yes, baby. Wow. 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 What do we have there? Oh, okay. YSL. YSL, guys. One of my favorite perfumes. Very nice. One of them. Before we hit the road, can I get a, a spritz of that, you think? Why not? Oh, That's nice. Nice. I love it. Let's see it again. Oh, wow. Oh. YSL, guys. Oh, honey. I can't say no to that. <laughs> okay. Oh, my God. Careful, I have to sit next oh to you on the God, drive honey. down there. Ooh, oh, oh, no, not the eyes. That does okay. smell, that smells real good. It smells so good. So mm -hmm. guys, let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, grab your bags, let's get out of here. See you guys. Guys, we are in the car and Isaac, our driver, just did this for us. Actually, for me. <laughs> <laughs> and guess what, guys? Oh, feels like an anniversary. Any happy anniversary to us? Yeah, I've seen them. I've showed them. Yes, it does feel Aww. like an anniversary. This is beautiful. Thank you, Isaac. Thank you, Isaac. I love you guys. So I love you too. Yeah, so Thank you. What are you willing, Papa? We have for me. What are you willing, Umuyeti? We have a Namulewa. Oh, see. Hotel number five, guys. There we are. Henny, are you excited? Baby, I'm so excited. You better be happy anniversary. Happy anniversary it to be. Earth. To Earth, to Earth. So happy. So happy, you're not talking about Tina. Tina is already saying, I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so you willing. Why are you willing? The hotel is so kind. They gave us flowers for our anniversary, and this was so much of a surprise. Thank you, hotel number five. Thank Baby, you so much. Check this out. They also gave us wine. Oh my god. You wow. guys. Pulling out all the stops. This is the best hotel in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Happy anniversary, baby. Happy anniversary, honey. Thank you. Aww. Welcome, baby. Thank you, love. So, guys, like you all know, we are at hotel number five, and this is our room. Da kiri lenda i tiyo ho 
kama kesi ni hutegera vivyo ulisindu si show kama ni kako So this is the bathroom and guess who that is your one and only Amito Michara <laughs> So when we checked into the hotel, we rested for like two hours in the room and then woke up and decided to prepare for the dinner. Honey had requested them to prepare a dinner setup for us that looked so beautiful. I think I forgot to take a whole video of how it looked like but it looked so good when this restaurant of theirs that has some greenery honey loves green and i was happy that um their restaurant was next to that greenery you know they have two restaurants the previous time we were here we were at the other restaurant but this time around i loved where we sat the green was greening honey's favorite color is green you all know already it was really a beautiful uh, moment so me i'm there minding my business sipping on juice guess what ngahani comes and kneels down on one knee and proposes and he's like oh my sweetheart will you marry me <laughs> i was over the moon i was so happy i was like oh my god i just couldn't wait for this moment i've always been praying for it yes i'll marry you even in the next life you're my soulmate i'm so happy you guys so at that moment we had already ordered for like dinner dinner came after that whole you know emotional what do they call it like that period when you guys are so emotional at what like i'm so happy i've been proposed to like i want to cry but i don't want to cry you know but anyway the food came we ate me i didn't eat i'll i'll be lying if i if i told you guys that i ate because i was nervous not because i didn't have appetite but because I was still thinking through what had just happened, you know. <laughs> but anyway, the hotel blessed us with this cake um, to congratulate us for that milestone. I was so happy. My ring is diamond. It looks so pretty. Very, very pretty, you guys. I love it. I fell in love with it. So I removed that promise ring and only remained with the um, engagement ring. I am so happy. Came back to the hotel and I was just smiling. <laughs> i was just smiling i didn't know what to say just snapping and smiling it was a really beautiful day thank you so much honey yeah that's good breakfast time i'm having african tea spice honey is having very strong coffee mm -hmm. very strong <laughs> with some fruits i'm also having fruits here mm -hmm. let's wait for the next meals I'm having bacon, some tomato, beans. I really didn't want the sausages, but it's okay. Honey and waffles. What kind of muffin is that? Muffin? You said banana. 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 I asked oat. for it. Oh yeah, this this is mine. Mm -hmm. It's a banana oat muffin. So we finally checked out of hotel number five and headed home. We were staying in two places but this time around we had gone to my place and i gathered all these guys together and asked them about what they thought about the proposal and these are their reactions so andrew come and say hi come and say hi hello world what should i say greet them because they're going to be on youtube youtube family 
Hello YouTube family from Uganda. Coming at you live from Amido Mitra's YouTube MTV Cribs. <laughs> I am here with about four extra people and so all this time I was planning an anniversary and honey was plotting with Tina and my younger sister Lillian to propose to me but somehow I, I th you know my boyfriend doesn't keep secrets so it gets easy for me to understand what he is up to he wasn't he wasn't settled if I saw him panicking and I knew he was going to propose but I wasn't sure I was just feeling it but I wasn't sure there is there is a time actually I got into his phone and he was texting Tina and Lillian and I got to know oh this guy is planning something but I loved it thank you so much of course of course uh, like I said uh, you knew as much as you needed to know but not too much more so I think it was Actually, I know for a fact when the moment came, it was definitely a surprise. Yeah, it was. Okay, so now what do you think about the proposal? You're so nosy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so nosy. I remember that time mm -hmm. when you came to my place. And, uh, you know, you just were discussing about other things, I think. And you're like, I know Steve is going to text you about the proposal. Sam. I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh no, because Steve was texting. And yeah, yeah, yeah. So I used the bombastic side eye to see what he was, uh, who he was talking to. And I realized he was texting you. So I was like, mm, I think this guy is texting. Because there is no way. If, if Steve wants us to go somewhere, he'll be like, oh, honey, plan this. Let's go. And I would plan. Because he knows I'm the best planner in this world. Oh, wow. <laughs> so by the time he was texting you. I knew something was up. So when I met you, I just, you know, <laughs> I just I was like, I know Steve is going to text me about something, but I also wanted you to know that don't choose places that I would not like. <laughs> and I remember telling you that I just must. So <laughs> I literally wanted her. I know she was planning something, but I was like, don't choose places that I'm not going to like. If it is a proposal, let it be somewhere that I will. <laughs> I will always remember, oh, every time I pass in TV, oh, hotel number five was where I got this ring from. So, yeah. Well, we had a list of uh, final candidates as far as the location goes. Yeah. And then you went for each one and said, mm, not that one. Yeah, <laughs> actually, one. we had four places in mind for the anniversary because, of course, it, about the proposal, it was between Steve, Tina, and Lillian. But I personally wanted us to go to Latitude Zero, Mestil, Serena Chigo, and or oh, oh, um, Hotel Number no. Five. Those are my four options. But I sat down and I realized I've been to Chigo so many times. I've celebrated like two birthdays at Chigo, and then been to Latitude, and I I loved the place too. But um, I mean, Mestil. We had been at Mestil the previous week, right? So I didn't want us to go back. So I had two options left that was um latitude zero and um hotel number five we actually paid latitude zero as well so honey wanted us uh, to get like um a certain deco table deco i told tin about it and latitude was not ready to do that yes so we had to cancel we had even paid and all that so we told them we are not coming anymore and then we went to hotel number five we loved hotel number no. five because when honey came in july we had dinner there and it was a very beautiful place they really went above and beyond i mean let's exactly. use this uh, opportunity to shout them out because mm. they had flowers for us they had wine for us the dinner setup was extravagant like they really uh did a lot for us sure so hotel number no. five you did the most thank you thank you so much andrew tell us when Steve told you about the proposal, you hadn't come to Uganda yet. How did you feel? I felt supportive and uh, I was just rooting for Steve every step of the way and I was looking forward to hearing back on the experience. And now I'm, I'm really getting the full story. Yeah. Of, of, uh, what transpired. Uh, yeah. mm. well, for you, I don't think it was much of a surprise because I think we had talked about it stateside. Yeah, Steve had been talking about it for a long time, mm -hmm. so it, uh, I always knew how serious he was about you and him, so I, uh, I sort of expected him mm -hmm. to come with a ring, 
your boy went on his knees and said, Will you marry me? <laughs> yeah. That's, That's so cute. How it's supposed to be. Yeah. But you know, all the time I couldn't pull the camera. You know, like the yeah, moments where you just don't, you just want them to be about the two of you. So I didn't pull the camera, but it was so sweet. Did you cry? No. She was, I've never seen her that quiet. She just I was so quiet. I didn't know what to say. She could understand what was happening. Yeah. What's that? Don't tell me she was shocked. Very shocked. Of really? course. Uh -huh. Oh. It's a big moment. <laughs> So I wasn't really it. shocked. I was just speechless. So it's like, okay, what's this? You understand? Yeah. This is real. Yeah, it was. At that moment, I realized it was real. All this while, I thought we were joking. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. No going back? No going back. Nasa, tell us. Oh, by the way, you guys. Anyway, we I think the next... NASA. Yeah, shout. Actually, because of Nasa, I'm going to turn the camera. I didn't want to turn it, but... Nasa, Nasa is camera shy. Let me leave him. Okay, Nasa, tell us. By the way, um, just for you guys to know, we did Kuchala, and that will be the, the next video after this. And I don't know whether I should talk about it now or in the next video, but Nasa is a very good friend. Nasa, should I start? No, don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. <laughs> Nasa has been my friend since university and most of my friends and the people who follow me on social media know nasa but this time around he got me emotional because like you all know steve and andrew are not ugandans so them handling this whole issue of you know coming to meet my parents wasn't going to sit so easily on them but when we told nasa about it nasa has been working out of the country for the past i don't know three months something but we when we told nasa about it he just bought his ticket immediately just to come and you know be there for me first of all and then for steve and andrew thank you so much nasa i don't thank know you so much <laughs> Say thank you to NASA. Yes, well, of course, I'm going to use this opportunity to say thank exactly. you. Nasa. You've been such a nice no, friend. No, no, I'm going to take this opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> I really want to. It's a pleasure, man. The VIP. VIP, yes. NASA shocked me. So I was. I'm, I'm so humbled. May God bless you and bless you abundantly. Amen. Yeah. I've always thought you were my friend, but now I know you're my very good friend. Good friend. Mm. Very good friend. I've always thought you were my friend, but now I know you're my very good friend. That's it. So it's good to there for friends like mm. you. and um so when i saw it actually i saw it on her status i was like oh okay this is happening mm -hmm. <laughs> so i was really happy and um yeah. this is um this is one of those steps that we have to go through mm. so i'm really happy for you uh, all the best in your next journey thank you nasa so, god bless you you're the next in line <laughs> next Amen. year next year mm. i think i'll also be next year but what? Mm. Wow. Have you finally gotten the girl or yeah, you're still searching? That's how always lies. He doesn't want people to reach out to him even when he doesn't have anyone. No, I have one. I have my girlfriend. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 <laughs> I have one good girlfriend of mine. Okay. Let me hope so. <laughs> I know you. Please, next year. Um, He's been saying next year since 2018. No, no, no. This time round. I'm serious. Next year, get your Gomez. Uh, Steve and Andrew, you officially invite. Well, this is Amito and, and Steve. It does not. <laughs> so, forward. wedding, intro, everything. At once. That's it, go. Oh. Yeah, we'll be going to the East, definitely. Wow. Oh, nice. East where? Wow. Where is the East? Tina. <laughs> calm down, baby. Calm down. <laughs> anyway, let me tell you the truth. Nasa's girlfriend is a cousin to my in-law. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Which in Um, you remember the wedding we had recently? Yeah. At Tendere? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So anyway, um, guys, that was it about the proposal. We are all happy. Okay. Well, this oh, one is camera shy. No, but he just had to tell us, tell us something. Like said, this, this, something. this trip would not have been possible without, without Kill. Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> He's not shy. Don't cry. Don't cry. Kumba is the man behind the curtain making it all happen. Yeah. <laughs> He's always man come through scenes. for us. Yeah, I know. 
anyway guys thank you so much for watching may god bless you and bless you abundantly see you in the next video i love you all i know you all missed me but i'm back back on back back, 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 back to back back to back back to back content see you guys in the next video bye bye